so 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 chicken shish kebabs and I'm going to be using that um, jerk seasoning the, the, the ground the powder jerk seasoning and the wet jerk seasoning on my chicken I don't see no sense of mixing up new um, seasonings because this seasoning has everything you can possibly want in it now, if you'll check out my channel, Dry and Wet Jerk Seasoning, it will show you what you uh, what's go what goes in there, okay? And um, if you'll come down here, I can show you how I'm gonna do this, okay? Okay, guys, I have already cleaned my chicken thighs off, okay? I've already cleaned them off, and I'm going to lay them. Okay, I had to turn the video off because I wanted to get my gloves on. I'm going to lay them on the paper towel so that uh, the paper towel will soak up the moistness from the chicken, okay? And I have cut all my fat off, not all of it, but some of it, because I do want some of the fat to be left on the chicken thighs. Okay, now I'm going to dry the thighs off because I want to put olive oil and uh, some of the jerk seasoning on these chicken thighs. And I want the seasoning to adhere to the meat. Okay. Next, I'm going to cut them up in bite-sized pieces. And I did get skewers that I'm gonna put them on. And I've got the wooden skewers also, okay? So we, next we're cutting the chicken up in bite-sized pieces. like this. And I'm gonna go away and cut the rest of them up. Okay? And I'll be back. Okay guys, next we're gonna add the jerk seasoning on the chicken. And you wanna get them good and seasoned, okay? Next, you're going to add the wet rub. And you can add any kind of seasonings you would like. <clears throat> Excuse me. On your chicken, you can add uh, adobo, uh, uh, seasoning salt, uh, garlic salt, or just whatever. 
kind of seasoning you would like on your chicken. And I'm choosing the jerk seasoning because I'm trying to use it all up. Okay. Now that we've got the chicken seasoned, I'm going to put it to the side and cut up my bell peppers, onions, and um, this is my bell pepper and onions. I wanted to add corn, but uh, I didn't have any corn. I couldn't find any corn in the freezer downstairs, so I, I left that out. But you can add any kind of vegetables that you want to your kebabs, okay? Okay, <clears throat> now make sure you wash your hands because we're going to another step. We're going to the vegetables. And uh, you don't want that chicken on your vegetables, okay? Now I've already cut up my vegetables and uh, rinsed them off. We've got yellow, orange, and red bell peppers along with the onions, okay? Okay, I'm gonna cut them in threes. After I slice them down. <clears throat> okay, I don't have any cooking spray. I think I used it up on that uh, cake that I did, that um, pineapple cake. But I'm gonna use coconut oil to wipe my skewers down. So that the meat and the vegetables will slide off, okay? Now with the wooden skewers, you have to let them soak in cold water for 30 minutes. And I'm gonna use them also because I only have four of the uh, regular skewers. Okay, so I'm gonna take a few out of here and soak them in, in water for 30 minutes. Cold water, hot water, it don't matter. Just soak them in water for about 30 minutes. Okay, now I'm going to, and I cut up some bacon. And this is to help season the meat. Okay, so now I'm gonna stick a piece of chicken on and bacon on. And make sure you put it down tight, okay? Now I'm putting bell pepper, green bell pepper, the onion, chicken meat, bacon, a red pepper, an onion, and you can put them on there how you like, however you like to put them on there. Just make sure that they're good and tight, push down, okay?
Now I'm gonna go away and put them all on here. Make sure they are good and tight. And make sure every time you put a chicken piece on there, you put a bacon piece on there because the bacon helps season the chicken, okay? Okay, guys, next I'm going to mix up a glaze. I've got one cup of um, barbecue sauce. Any kind of barbecue sauce you want to use. I use the Sweet Baby Ray's. Okay, and two tablespoons of mustard. Okay, Thai style sweet chili sauce. This is what I'm using. And in place of that, you can even use the orange sauce. And you get these items out of the uh, international uh, aisle, like the Chinese aisle. And uh, I'm going to put that in. And Sweet Home Hot Sauce. Now, like I told y'all the last time, this is something that uh, some local person makes in Alabama and sell it in the grocery store. I don't know what to um, to uh, exchange this out for, but uh, you don't have to use this. You can uh, use anything. I mean, uh, and I'm gonna put like two tablespoons of that in here. Now, I really like that Sweet Home hot sauce. And uh, I'm choosing to use that today, okay? Now you're gonna mix it up really good. And now the kebabs. And I'm going to put just a little olive oil on the kebabs. And then I'm going to shake a little funky chicken seasoning on it by Paula Dean. Okay. Now, I, and, and I tasted the sauce. And the sauce is delicious. Mm-hmm. The glaze, rather. The glaze is delicious. Okay. And I'll be right back. Even though we have the uh, seasonings on this, I want to put some extra seasonings on, okay? I'm going to stick these in the oven, in the 350 oven for about maybe uh, 35 minutes until the uh, seasonings, I mean, until it gets uh, done, your chicken gets done. So I'm going to stick them in there for like 35 minutes and I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm going to put a little glaze on the... Uh, Chicken kebabs. Then I'm going to put them back in 
for about maybe five minutes. Two, three, four, five minutes. The chicken is done. And the vegetables are just, just got a little crunch to them. Okay, and I'll be right back. It's gotta be against the law to look this damn good. Cause baby, I feel real good and I wish I would. It's gotta be against the law to look this damn good. Everybody, watch out. Watch out now. I'm ready for a good time And I came to groove The whole band's here and we came to move Got a fresh haircut and two new shoes We're here all night like we got nothing to lose I'm coming out the jacket cause we're turning up the heat I wanna see you clapping when you get up out your seat It's time to make it happen when we hit these streets I'm coming in hot and I can't be beat Watch out now Baby, watch out now Watch out 